just hit my spot lock. That's like the greatest feature ever. You can be fighting your fish and doing your thing and just let that boat stay and you're not drifting on top of the spot or anything like that. Now that one got it. I've been getting him. I got that one on the main hook and got him with the trailer hook too. And I never throw a spinner bait without a trailer hook and it's important to, to get them on right. Let's get him back. Nice chunker one. But if you're not putting your trailer hook on this way, you're doing it, um, you're not doing yourself justice. So you wanna put your trailer hook on, and this is my favorite right here. This is a little Mustad short shank 2 aught. Um, it's got a, just a little plastic keeper that keeps it from going over the bar, but it's on there free to swing. You know, a lot of the trailer hooks got a little rubber tubing, you put it over it and poke the whole thing on, and sometimes it's riding off to the side. No matter what your spinnerbait's doing, if you're letting it fall, um, you know, if you're burning, if you kill it, it always rides right there in the back of the skirt, and that's real important. So it's free to swing. And again, that little short shank one is really weedless in the wood in that. So just get him tuned back up, get back out there and get another one. If you want to learn more about what it's like out in the tournament trail, follow me on social media, go to my YouTube channel, or go to kevinvandam.com.